Hello all and welcome back to High Priest Reacts to My Little Pony, Friendship is Magic, Season 7, Episode 7, Parental Glidance. And if, even if that name was a dead giveaway that this is the one involving Dash's parents, I, I knew this episode would involve our, uh, Dash's parents for a while now. A long while. It's been a bit of a while. Like, uh, months before the Copa thing came up and I put those, uh, disclaimers at the beginning of the videos. Yeah. Before, uh, the rest of DuckTales and Ruby Volume 7 came out. But I put aside some time and... I'm going to be do it, fit, doing as much as I can to get as close to finishing the season and then finishing up in the rest of the time. Which is going to be harder now since the computer I was using for editing broke. God damn it. Before I could... Oh, I... I and yeah, that's another thing. Swearing is on bat now in full force. Fuck shit. God damn fuck 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 fuck. God shit shit fuck fuck. No more trying to censor myself. Not that I was doing a great job anyways. Some kid comes on here. It's not my fault. These videos aren't for kids. And now, YouTube doesn't have the bullshit excuse that they're trying, that they're aiming everything to kids. Because the FCC told them to quit that shit. But, uh, right, uh, the computer I, I used to edit, which is my personal computer, broke. So now, uh, I'm, it's gonna take longer than it was going to. Like, I, I've estimated to two or three weeks of constantly watching, uh, reacting and videos, and now I'm gonna be editing for a while before you guys see anything. I want want will want most of these ed at least half of these edited down before I start uploading it videos. That's gonna take longer since I can't edit and react at the same time now, or edit and stream. Knowing it's fuck. Uh. And yes, that means the show is over by this point. I didn't have that much hopes of catching up when I started, but I was hoping to get a little closer. And uh, I pretty much already figured out there's a big epilogue uh, scene with the time skip and it evolved. Because I saw a picture of uh, uh, a Celestia style Twilight. And I know that was straight from the episode. It looked too good. So, yeah. I know that happens. I don't know any other details. I've tried to stay away. I still haven't seen the movie. I'm pretty sure I saw one of the characters from the, the, the villain of the movie. I think I was the villain, anyways, because I don't know nothing about the vil movie. I didn't watch, I've never watched the trailers. Because they want spoilers for this season. Things haven't worked out so great in that front, but I've done my best. Uh, but yeah, with that, things change. I'm not going to be censoring myself anymore. No cutting around with swears, cutting out swears, no fucking censoring the fucking things. And I, I'm actually a, a person who swears a lot. That, and this goes for my DuckTales videos, too. Because, again, I felt like YouTube would shove those in the kids' faces. Because that's what, what YouTube wants to do. They want to market towards kids. But they're not supposed to do that. And while they seem to have convinced the FCC that they should be going after us instead of them, given they keep ignoring everything the FCC tells them to do even now... It's only a matter of time to late until they get in trouble. And again, as the disclaimer says, this isn't meant for kids. If it was a general audience threat writing, it would be perfectly fitting there. Because, yeah, a kid could watch it. 
But it's not meant for kids. It's just meant for, you know, anyone. Anyways, uh, yeah. 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 So yeah, I'm I'm going to be doing a lot more reactions than I normally do and as quickly as I can to try to get this done before the next season of anything starts. But if even if something starts before that, uh, two or three weeks time passes, hey, well, I want to get this season done. Then whatever else gets done, gets done, needs to get done, gets done. And then we hit up the next season. Until we're done with this bullshit. Anyways, uh, yeah. I don't mean I'm not touching any of the, the extremely rare sex jokes I made. I've been tempted to make. Like, I think I've only done it, had a, a temptation to do it once, but I held back. Anyways, let's get to this. I question the uh, intelligence of this idea. Too late! <laughs> well, little man, are you all right? Oh, hey! Rainbow's parents. What a quinky dink. Uh, yes, Bo Hotter at your service. Oh, hot ho. That that horrifies me. I think it's time. And that's disgusting. So she was always in the turtles. Oh no, this is a rainbow one of the rainbow's secrets, isn't it? Installed the sound effects myself. <laughs> <laughs> I like him. She was wearing it when she spoke her first words ever when she threw her. Wow, okay, biggest fan is probably right. Uh wow, well that's uh Well, I may have a ton of dash Whoa, that is I don't have any of those rainbow dash getting accepted into the Wonder Mode Academy. Oh no, she had to talk to her parents. Which, given from this room, I can see why a bit. Great timing. Great door. Yeah, <laughs> that is a great door. Her parents are sharing so loud they created turbulence. <laughs> you are. <laughs> Good one! <laughs> Is something wrong? Yeah, you should have warned me that you were bringing my parents in here. It's a little bit embarrassing. Huh? Really? Yeah, definitely. Great. <laughs> Too far. Not the best way to say it, but. That's exactly what I did. Is that the young members of the Wonderbolt she worked with? Uh, was that a purpose or was this being lazy? 
Maybe. Oh, we're doing scooter parents. I wonder where that ego came from. Yeah, there, there's a difference between confidence and being egotistical, and suddenly everything about Rainbow's overinflated ego makes sense. And that is definitely something you don't want in Stale. Hopefully I think they've learned their lives in the back down a little bit. Because, again, yeah. Oh, fucking dorks. <laughs> and I do like the, the detail that the sandwich actually was moldy. <laughs> like, yeah, uh, just... D don't just stick a sandwich into your freaking report, especially when it's not immediately tomorrow. I mean, don't do that in general, because that was gross before it got moldy. Ah. And also, just, ah, super carb sandwich. Ah, keep it away, keep it away. I'm like, I'm not the ma a major carb counter, but, uh. I still do try to keep track of that stuff, and that's just, ah. <clears throat> All in one meal. <sighs> also. Yeah, no, uh, her parents definitely took it too far. I, I, I know what the episode's trying to say, but. I had planned to replace support of, but even I, but, personal experience time. Yeah, my parents were funny supportive. Not anywhere near this bad, but I still say they took my, they took their praise too far and created some problems for me later in life. Even intentionally, unintentionally. And that was through something that was nowhere near that bad. I mean, there is a strong possibility something like that could literally uh, cripple you socially. Support is important. But not only is there a certain point where it stops feeling like it's, in, like, uh, it's real and genuine. It may, this could also lead to the problem of you expecting it. Or worse, like I said, you don't think it, think of it as real and meaningful. Because it's just the default way of talking to you. That you become incapable of, uh, recognizing it when it happens with a normal person. That one's particularly out there. Usually it's the other problem. You know, you get built up, you get built up into thinking, into legitimately believing all they're telling you is true. And then you hit reality hard and fail. And, uh, oop, you weren't prepared for the deal with that. Yeah. It's, uh, suddenly... Dash's many, many problems in the series suddenly make all the sense. Just like... Dang. It's just, yeah. I can totally see why she uh, also didn't want to tell him, because, yeah, no. Like, let's leave it in the fact that fireworks literally were endangering people. I know ponies tend to be tougher -er than normal than people in real life, but no, that's a that was an actual hazard to uh no. Uh 
and O, oh, and uh, oh boy, that's we at the beginning with uh, <clears throat> uh, Scootaloo. Honestly, this episode was filled with a lot of funny, funny stuff, but yeah. I'm not quite agreeing with the way the moral is. I mean, yeah, okay, appreciate your parents. That's good. And all they've done for you. That's good. But I'll also just assert, like, and say that, uh, what they did out of good intentions couldn't also be damaging. Even being overly supportive. <clears throat> That being said, yeah, no, they were hilarious. And I like I, I like Rainbow's dad just because of the door. Just because of that door. The And Scootaloo's excellent use of it. <laughs> uh poor Charlie at the end having to deal with that. <clears throat> uh. That was a a, a a really good episode. I'm not going to sure, sure how I rank it dress this season because it's been a while since I watched uh, them all. <clears throat> but, uh, yeah. And, uh, heh, uh also, uh, I've said before on other things, I have quit making uh, movie reviews, but there's an exception. This. Because it's connected to the series, I feel like making a movie review is the best thing. <clears throat> and. Hold on. What the? Oh. <laughs> I was briefly confused with something in the background because I, I, I didn't even. wasn't even processing it. It's an exercise bike. And it looked like it was sticking out of the box with the, with the upside down Pikachu. It's like, what the hell is? Ah, <laughs> uh, anyways, I can't wait to catch. Like I said, I can't wait to catch up with this season so I can actually watch people's reactions and watch the episodes, and most importantly, watch at least a little bit of the Brony Reacts series, especially that. Could I miss that? That was really funny. <clears throat> uh, be, uh, actually, the way her parents reacted to Scootaloo's story, I think, reminded me a bit of uh, that. I thought we'd get out of Brody reaction. I I I really hope they did they did that episode this, this episode on that because that. Cause I can't help see everyone going in sync with the parents would have been hilarious. Oh well. <sighs> Sorry for signing out, and I will see you all next time, folks.